What is up, everybody? Welcome back. It is, uh, I'm out here at the ranch, and it was a hot one today. Been working out here a little bit today. Our, uh, if you didn't know, our house here is, uh, completely off the grid. So it's all ran by solar panels, and my dad does all the work on it, and he is down at the coast fishing right now. So I had to come out here and check on it, and the batteries, you actually had to fill with water every so often, um, to keep them going. I don't know how it works, but I just had to come out here and do that. And then I am putting uh, a fifth wheel hitch in the back of my truck. So maybe there'll be a video soon on the reason why I'm doing that. Uh, hunting season's coming and we're gonna have something fun to uh, be riding around in. So um, I only have like an, maybe 30 minutes left till dark, but I'm out here. I figure why not throw on the binos. I'm in shorts, flip flops, and uh, I got the air gun. I got the 50 cal air gun. So let's oh so let's take this bad boy do i have air i have air so let's take this bad boy go sneak around in the golf cart maybe come across a pig we'll see what happens you never know what's going to run across out here so i got cameras got my binos got my flip-flops got the 50 cal let's get after it I actually, so when I got here, right over there by the old Can-Am, about a seven foot chicken snake ran between my legs. I'm having bad luck with snakes here lately. So you're probably wondering why I'm wearing shorts and flip flops, but I've been sweating my butt off all day. I have pants and boots in the truck, but I don't really plan on getting out of the golf cart unless I absolutely have to stalk these pigs, but normally, you can get pretty dang close with this golf cart because it's so quiet. So let's just go for a little cruise, see what happens. And if we don't get anything, we don't get anything. We'll still figure out something fun to do. Um, but y'all drop in the comments what y'all like to see before actual season, before actual hunting season approaches, which is very soon. Um, and if you're new to the channel, please hit that subscribe button. Uh, we do a lot of hunting and fishing on this channel. But we're going to focus more on hunting since uh, it's hunting season. Since hunting season is so close. We have dove season in just like a week and a half, maybe two weeks, September 1st, whenever that is. And then and then I go straight to elk hunting and then mule deer hunting, then back for whitetail, then back for mule deer, and then back for mule deer again, three states. So we got a lot, we got a lot of hunts to look forward to. But this camera's really heavy, so I'm gonna put it down and uh, show you all this awesome view. Well, <clears throat> obviously it is daylight and we didn't run across anything last night. Sat at the feeder there for a long time, um, actually till about 30 minutes after dark, nothing ever came in except for a couple whitetails. 
but I wasn't gonna do this in this video, but it's here. I got it this morning, and uh, the reason why I was putting the fifth wheel hitch in my truck yesterday is because I got a new hunting rig that I can take the family with, and the Can-Am, and everything else, all my hunting gear. Hunting season's gonna be absolutely insane this year. Um, it is a used fifth wheel toy hauler, but new to us, and uh, I think it's gonna work out great for us. So here it is. It is a Elevation, I don't even know the name of it. Elevation 39 footer with a 12 foot garage. It's got three slide outs. Um, this thing is a freaking tank. Triple axle. You can see my truck is sagging a little bit. I'm probably gonna get airbags for it. But uh, I just got it home. It looks like it's about to rain. I just got everything set up on it. Um, I do have to mess with the generator. Um, it was, the generator hadn't been ran in a long time and it had zero gas in it and I had to put a new battery in it. So I went and got a new battery. Put a new battery in there and uh, it's turning over but it won't fire up. So I gotta figure that out. Um, but other than that, everything I gotta, I'll show you here in a minute the inside, but we'll go over this whole thing, give you all a little tour of uh, the new hunting home. This is literally gonna be our home for hunting season. So anytime we are not at our home home, this will be our home away from home. And um, that's my plan with this is to take Ryder and Angel and the dogs on a lot of my hunts. I, I had a big mess up earlier too. You'll see here in a minute. I scraped the side of the new toy hauler pulling out of the gate and uh, hit our um, electric gate uh, keypad. Scraped all down the side of this thing. Oh well, it's gonna get, it's gonna get bruises and scratches. So, uh, obviously, start out, it is a, four, it's 41 feet, but it's a 39.12, um, but the specs say it's 41 feet long. Um, so this is pretty much the outside. This is like the kitchen area slide. Got some speakers out here. Awning. Um, one thing that we are looking for is this little playpen in the back. So it's like a back patio, but it's got a fence so Ryder can sit back here and play. And as well as the dogs. Um, but this also goes all the way down uh, so I can load the Can-Am up in there. Um, I'll show you all the inside of that when we get inside. So this is a wraparound gate and then it's got a door just like that um got you a little ladder go up to the top this is a fueling station so fill it up right there this also runs the generator but fill that gas tank up and i can fill the can-am up there's a gas nozzle in there that's my electrical hookup um big slide out over here on this side uh, that's like the living room and then that's the master bad that's the master bedroom on the front um, huge storage space on this guy I don't think I can do it oh, I can do it with one hand um, see-through storage right there um, see-through I don't know what you call it uh, here's all my water tank crap I don't know any of this yet but got a little outdoor shower that comes out cool stuff like that I gotta learn all this stuff because I don't know it um, got propane tanks right here I'm using this a lot in the winter months and um, this thing's massive it really is it's, it's almost too big but these things are insanely priced right now and uh, I feel like I got a good deal on this one so went ahead and got it um, going inside screen door like they all have um, and there are some things that were changing I still have to clean this thing out it's not hasn't been cleaned so there's stuff laying around just to let you know I don't have the lights on either because the generator's not on and I haven't plugged it in so coming to the inside this is our kitchen area um, got a little stove with an oven stove top three, uh, three burner microwave angel's probably gonna take all this out she wants to redo everything um so she said she's gonna take that out and do some stuff got the fridge 
on uh, at the fridge slash freezer uh, tons of storage that's our sink obviously it's a huge countertop uh, so I don't think we're gonna have trouble eating good in this bad boy um, and then I don't even know I really don't even know how to show you guys this thing it's so big um, the couch we're re we're putting a new couch in it uh, we actually looking at them online today um, so we might order a new couch we don't know what we're gonna do yet tons of storage up there um, all those lights come on well two of them do I don't know where the I believe the other ones work but if not I should have to change the light bulbs um, got some like reading lights in the corners tons of windows uh, they all have blinds and then here's a little loft walk up these stairs and it's like a full-size full bed um, so I'm sure if you go hunting with me you're probably gonna be sleeping right there or in the back because we got this sliding door that goes to the garage slash back patio um, I have the table open right now it's got a little TV back here uh, got a kicker sound so let's see if it works let's see I hear it it's playing outside I'll turn that off right now so we got that got some curtains screen door that goes on the glass door I need to put that in okay the radio is on Turn that off. Um, this is cool. We got two doors here. Sorry, not doors. Two beds. These are on slides. So they come down. I'm not going to put them all the way down, but got speakers everywhere. So these are like two couches that are on either side that fold out into a bed. And then the top one is an actual bed. I want to say it's like a queen size or a king size bed. So obviously I won't have a table in here because there's going to be... A candy I'm in here uh, got another door going outside here's the uh, little outdoor patio it's super stable I didn't think it's gonna be that stable um, you can see better so the two couches that go on either side and then the big bed on top got some Bose speakers you know what it is um, he left me some left me some hickory wood for my smoker for my camp chef so like I said, I got to clean out a little bit, but no big deal. Um, I believe this is a bike rack up here. Not real sure what a lot of this stuff is. As you can see, I'm sweating my butt off too. Um, I don't know what this is. Max Air Air Cell. I'm going to guess that there's a fan in here. I don't think that there, there's not an AC unit in here. But there's two. There's one in the main living room area and then one in the master bedroom. Um, these stools go right here. We, we're, Angel's gonna change a lot. So I think we're gonna do like a little series video on the progression of our hunting home. That's what we're gonna call it. The hunt. If y'all can think of a better name, drop it in the comments. Let's name this thing. Um, so I can be like, hey, we're going on this hunt to stay in and we're gonna be taking old Sheila or whatever. Y'all come up with a name for this ginormous trailer. Um, so got a couple stairs go upstairs let me show y'all upstairs here's our ac uh heat all that good stuff got our bathroom what's up guys howdy um a toilet got a fan gotta have the fan get those uh those nasty fumes out of here after you blow it up and then i uh, got your sink another mirror and your big uh sit down shower whatever you want to call it then you come over here got your nice little fancy door um to the master bedroom and we are we have another mattress for it that we're gonna put in here got a tv in here as well bunch of storage john norma's closet um got more shelves and uh all kinds of stuff in here so 
Angel can bring all of her stuff and I can pack all my hunting clothes. Um, and this thing blows cold. So I'm gonna be sleeping good, getting a good night's rest on all these big hunts. I can't wait. Windows literally everywhere. Uh, so yeah, uh, there's, I mean, there's so much stuff y'all are probably seeing that I'm not saying, but big old light fixture in the middle. Um, so we have a lot to do uh, to get ready for hunting season. There's obviously a lot of storage that I didn't show y'all, but um, I have not even opened like a quarter of the storage that's in here. So I don't even know what's, I don't even know what's storage and what's not. Um, but I'm gonna spend the rest of the day going through this whole thing, cleaning it out, and uh, hopefully getting that generator going because uh, that's gonna be real important where we're hunting. So we're not gonna be hunting Probably not gonna be camping a whole lot at like actual campsites. We're gonna be camping off the side of the road or up in the mountains. Um, kind of where I deer hunted last year. I got a good spot picked out that I think will be great for the family. Um, and uh, it'll be a blast, so I can't wait. But that is, I spilled the beans on the new Mullet Man Mobile. Um, I wasn't gonna show y'all for like a couple weeks until we got it all uh fixed up and everything but who knows what it's gonna look like here in a couple weeks i know angel wants to do a lot of it i know angel wants to do a lot to it i don't know exactly what she wants to do but she wants to she's talking about painting and all kinds of stuff so this thing could look completely different a couple weeks i have no idea so uh y'all leave in the comments if y'all want to see more videos on this beast of a trailer it's probably like 50 foot with that porch on the back which is insane. There she is. The one that's going to change everything on this trailer. What all? Hey, Bubba. I'm just going to make it homey. You like your new home? <laughs> oh, look. Deer. Say, whoa. Say, whoa. He's starting to say, every time we go uh, out to the ranch or in the house or he comes to my office, he points at the deer mounts on the wall and says, duh, duh. So we're working on it. We're working on a full deer. But uh, I think this thing is going to have a lot of deer in it um, this season. But we're just going to try it out this year. If we don't like it or it doesn't work out, I'm going to sell it. And we'll just Airbnb it like we have in the past or stay at lodges. But uh, I was just spending so much money on Airbnbs that it just made sense to um, get a big toy hauler that I can still take the Can-Am with. Because I was trailering the Can-Am everywhere and then I wouldn't have anywhere to stay. And then third season, fourth season, y'all know it gets super cold, it's snowy. I'm not gonna stay at a tent and I'm definitely not gonna take Ryder and Angel uh, to stay in a tent. So um, this is what we have. I love it, I hope, I hope I love it. We'll see, We'll uh, maybe we'll get out in the next week or two, take it to the lake or something, or uh, drive to New Mexico or something and camp for a couple days, see how we like it. Take the dogs, take the Can-Am and uh, Go have some fun but this is it hope you guys enjoy it um y'all are gonna see a lot more videos with this thing i'm guessing but uh hunting season is just right around the corner and i'll be taking this on its first hunt in just a couple weeks so i can't wait um see how it performs and see how it actually works for us so hope you guys enjoy this video it's just kind of a vlog style video but i do have some hunts coming y'all's way and oh before I leave, y'all probably wanted to see what I messed up. This right here is from our gate opener deal. So, yeah, I just, I smoked the uh, keypad when I turned out and it just put that whole streak across it. Oh well. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Hit that subscribe button. Thanks for subscribing if you already have. I appreciate everybody's support. If you want some merch or some spice, uh, I have my own spice. You can get it linked in the description, mulletman.net. And uh, I'll catch you guys on the next one. And remember, eat good.